Okay. Oop, focus, so we can see. Alright. Here's a video that I told you that was going to get uploaded and next upcoming video. Well, here it is. Um, for that noise in the background, you'll understand what it is after I unbox this and tell you what the other one was. This is basically the upgraded version of it. Only one thing I can tell you is that this company is no longer a company anymore because they went bankrupt in 2012 or 2013 like that. Um, this is a piece of network hardware and it was off of eBay, not Amazon, even though it came in an Amazon box, which I kind of thought was weird, but oh well, they reused the box. But I uh, have the paper covering it up because it's my address and all that. I need that uh, kept secret so nobody knows where I live. Okay, and then I'll start opening this up. One thing I didn't know is I heard something moving in the box, so don't know, but, but find out here in a minute. Oop, come on. Open. Yep, this tape's not wanting to work with me. Sure, do not lift that paper up. I'm not doing good camera angle today, I'll tell you that. <laughs> I'm just going all the way around the box, ain't I? Okay. Oh, Lord. I'm not doing the best today, I'll tell you that. That's uh, my own unique way of unboxing. <laughs> All right. Okay. Huh. And it's um I have a piece of paper in here. I probably don't need to show y'all. But anyways, um this was a demo product they had. It's considered new because it was demo. Like my computer, it was a demo product and it was pretty much liquidated. Uh, you might would say. This is not cutting. Okay, I may need to not show that, so oh, that's just a cardboard piece that paper out, which has my address on it, but then off to the side. And this is an actually no scratches on it whatsoever. They did not... They used some ingenuity like I did with the packaging. They used pieces of cardboard. And this is a Nortel Network Gigabit Switch. I'm going to pause the video so I can pull it out of the box. Alright, well here's the video uh, continuing. It's got 48 ports, 4 SFP, which actually they included a, um optical connector, didn't they? Which I... D oh yeah, they did. Cool. They included one. Just leave that in there. It automatically snaps in too. Oh, I see. That's how you open it. Okay. I've never... Oh, uh, I didn't even show that bit. I'll show you how it does it. That locks it in. And that... Well, you push down a little bit and you pull it out. And these cables are a little bit expensive than your old regular um, RJ45 connectors. Because those are like optical cables. And let me look, see if there's anything down in there. All the ports are not damaged. Um, the other switch over there now, same thing except for it only has four. SFP and it has power. This one is way different than the other one. That one does not have PUE. 
this one does, which means it injects power into each line by detecting it automatically if it requires it. So it means that instead of having a separate cable to power the security camera access point or whatever that is powered by PoE, it just is powered with a data and power line with the RJ45 connector. And on this side we have six cooling fans. Uh, that one has four. In the back, the one I have does not have a switch to turn it off and on. It does have a con regular old standard connector. doesn't have a uh, cord guide. That's about it for the whole deal. But, um... This only costs around uh, the $50 range off of eBay. Really good. That's gigabit. I don't see why anybody needs really 10 gigabit unless you're like a data center or really large media company that has 10 gig internet. But um, I'll pause the video and I'll try and set it up and make sure I don't damage it on that deal right over there. The and these do not have rec rails, which it, I can install it on here. The rec rails be just fine. Because I already have rec rails on that one. I just switch it on here. But I'll set it up here in a minute. I gotta unplug everything over there. Okay, there's the old switch. I gotta hurry because my battery's kinda running really low. There's the four fans. It's put over here and I'm gonna plug her up. Alright. Um hmm. neat, huh? I ain't even seen those lights on it before. Well, that it these will automatically light up uh, over here. And that is it for this video of the Nortel. Base stack, 5520 power, PoE, gigabit 48 port switch. Um, see you in the next video. Bye.